What's up guys? Hey, this is not the intro, but I'm just telling you a little bit about what this video is gonna be. So it sounds kind of like an intro, but that'll be later. So we're gonna be doing a little bit of a phone hack today, just cause you guys know I love taking pictures. If you watch me on uh, this channel, or definitely if you follow me on my Instagram, you know I'll be popping off the pics. So we're gonna be doing that. And also, we're going to be doing a, an event, or I don't know why I can, an event. We're gonna be going to Tim Tebow's event. And we're going to be doing um, a little bit of assisting there, which would be pretty awesome. I can't even think the word. It wouldn't be assisting, but it would be uh, a volunteering. So, hey, let's go ahead and get to that camera stuff and then go on with the day. So, let's get this baby going. You know what I'm saying? See you in a little bit. Well, you know, in a couple seconds. Let's go. I'm just trying to make a little quick uh, hack from my phone case. This is just a life proof case. Um, these are just really, you can get these lenses pretty much anywhere. Like, Best Buy, I mean, you can get them at Target, Walmart, it doesn't really matter. Um, in this section right here, it usually has like a little clip where it clips on to your phone. So you can do like a fish eye or like, you know, a wide angle, you know, or like a micro lens. And what happens is it screws into the clip and then it's like this giant clip that sits on the back of your phone, which is really weird to me. So all I did was, Attached to the clip is this ring. It's on the inside of the plastic clip. So with this clip, um, these lenses just screw in to the clip, which you attach to your phone. So I just took the plastic ring out of the clip and I'm just gonna actually glue it. I'm gonna glue it to the case so that I can just screw these in and out whenever I want. So I just used a little bit of crazy glue, super easy. I just glued the ring to the case and it screws right in. So now I don't have to use the giant clip and it just sits on your case, you know, just like that. So you can just put your case on or, you know, put your case on your phone and then just carry these and screw them right on whenever you want to, uh, you know, take a pic with uh, fish eye, wide lens, you know, whatever lens you have really. Hey man, that's how you do it. Um, there's a company that sells cases with their lenses that screw onto the case and they're like a hundred dollars for the case and one lens and each additional lens is a hundo so this is uh i got these lenses it's like four lenses for fifteen dollars and yeah that's how it's done at least for me because i don't want to spend a hundred bucks let's go <laughs> What's this arena? What is this? Anyway. Oh, you're right. Tropicana Fields in St. Pete. So we're going to get this popping off this Night of Hope. Uh, it's going to be pretty awesome. Tim Tebow is going to be talking. It's going to be pretty awesome. I mean, I'm going to do some videoing, uh, but we're, we're volunteering. We're going to be doing um, a greeting. So, hey. You know, if you're uh, new here, we're have family and welcome to vlog a seven day park. Hey, hey, hey. hey, at that note, let's get the day. Popping. Attendance Portland. 
Pretend it's Portland. Okay. Come on. Okay. B. Oh, getting it. All right, so we're greeting at the front door and then we're gonna eventually go inside. I mean, there's gonna be like over 20,000 people here. This is like really massive. This is crazy. Christmas yet to come. All right, so we're doing roadie work with Joy FM this time. I mean, hey, you were just all over the place. Get it, mommy. So how'd you like doing that? That's like roadie work. Yeah, that was fun. Yeah. Wheel and stuff around. Yeah. It's Everything's dumb. You can go inside now. So, Poppy, yeah, no, to go inside. Yeah, we can go in or we can we're go back to the front and go to greeting. Yeah, we're in. Yeah, no, we're let's go back to here. greeting. Let's, let's greet. It's up to you. Can we walk through to the no. greeting area? Well, here, I'm going to go inside and use the restroom and then we'll go back to greeting real quick. Do you need to go to the bathroom? Yeah. Let's go to the bathroom quick, greet, and then go back to greeting. They covered the field with this plastic. They covered it with plastic. Yeah, so it doesn't get ruined. Floor with plastic, so like the baseball floor doesn't get ruined with all these feet. It's pretty okay. Get that wave on! Oh, they're opening up that too. Make sure many people start beeping. Okay. Beep, 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 beep. Woo! I mean, I feel like I'm, I'm running for mayor. I feel like I'm running for mayor here. That was a pretty crazy. that decided you know what it's not about our banner it's about our church it's about God's church it's about people and so they decided to volunteer to get stand up straight the power of understanding that you are loved unconditionally should trump any sort of dysfunctional pattern in your life Because you've seen the power of what that love does for you and how it consumes those insecurities in your life and makes you not want what you used to want. And now you are in a relationship with Jesus who loves you for who you are and you can exchange in a relationship and dialogue. It should, there should not be that desire to want to gravitate back to what was because that was not healthy for you and you know it wasn't healthy for you. And God gives you a glimpse that says, remember that? Guys, there are times, and I don't know, sometimes lately, I'll have a thought process and it's like God gives me, like, you remember that? I'm like, no. <laughs> now, or if a flash will come up and I'm like, what was... I can't believe you love me in that because that was nasty. And how far you've come. Think about if anything else during this holiday season, if you're like, man, I'm loathing myself, I'm just depressed or I'm discouraged, think about how far you've come and what God has actually freed you from and healed you from in your life that was so dysfunctional that you can just thank God for His grace in your life, no matter if you see anything else taking place in your life, that you, well, God's not blessing me here. Just thank Him for the grace that you're not where you were and that you are where you are now and that you're free. Because when the sun sets free, it's free indeed. And it's good just to be able to sit and be at peace to know, man. So that is the vlog, guys. I want to thank you for watching. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And if you like the video, go ahead and run over to that like and go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the notification bell as well because we upload twice a week. Hey, and I'm pretty sure you want that notification, you know what I'm saying? But you know what to do. Love life, live life to its fullest. Hey, we out.